Hi, folks. Chris Foss here from thechrisfossshow.com, thechrisfossshow.com. Hey, we're coming here with the review we're going to do. Thinktankphoto.com. That's thinktankphoto.com. Our good friends there that I always travel with uh, when I go with my gear has sent us a ton of really cool stuff that we want to share with you. And, of course, these are going to individual uh, posts on YouTube and on the Chris Foss Show. Dot com, but we have the belts, we have the holsters, we have the bags, all this sort of stuff we'll be reviewing. So we're going to break away and review each of these individually. Be sure to search for each of the posts so you can see all the great reviews on all the wonderful Think Tank products we've done. Coming in here with a, another review of a great product. This is from one of my favorite companies, Think Tank Photo. Now, Think Tank Photo sent me a lot of different gear that we reviewed over the Chris Foss Show. Always been super, super impressed with it for camera gear, bags, all that sort of good stuff, messenger bags, laptop bags, uh, tablet bags, you name it. <clears throat> These guys make incredible, well-built gear, killer zippers, killer design, killer materials, uh, and everything else. Uh, to give you an example, I've pretty much done events in the last year, always taking my Think Tank bags with me, the airport takeoff and other different bags. Uh, and always been very impressed with them. I've beaten the ever-living crap out of them to take stuff with me. I actually use most of my camera bags sometimes for luggage. So I'll put my cameras in one half and I'll put my clothes in the other. So I've always been very impressed with their products. This is something that's really cool, especially if you have the belt system from Think Tank Photo. We'll show you that here in a second. But this is their digital holster. And they have several different versions of this so you can get one that works for you. This is the Digital Holster 50 version 2.0. And they have several different sizes and versions and everything else. Now I have a 700 to 200 milli, uh, millimeter uh, lens, the big kind of white one you see in the picture. And one of my problems is when I want to go somewhere with my lens, I always try and take my camera with me. <clears throat> The problem is, is I usually set it in the car seat, it's banging around, it's rolling around, it's getting dirt, it's getting dirt pushed into it. And I would love to have something where I can just carry it. You know, I can just take my camera, it's protected, I can set it in the car, it's not going to get busted or banged around. And so the beautiful part is, is this digital holster will take and do that for me. So, uh, let's go ahead and get into this and we'll show you some of the other great features about this. First, we're going to rip these tags off so we can get them out of the way so you can see the product much better. So, here you can see we've got a pocket that's in here, kind of an elastic area where yeah, we can store all sorts of good stuff. We've got a zippered area over here where we can take and put stuff in here, uh, whatever you want to take and do. The beauty of this bag is just all the different areas that you can take and put stuff. In here we have a uh, rain coat system where you can pull this out, put this over, and help rainproof it. And of course, if you want to put some little gear things in here, you could put stuff in here. And of course, this is also removable. So say you don't want to keep this in here, maybe you want to put like some smaller items in here, you can do that also. Very smart. I love the way they think about these bags. We're going to set that aside for a second. And you can see here it's got class, so if you want to take and turn this into a, a shoulder bag, you can take and do that and everything else. So, uh, let's take a look at what we have. Here's kind of the front or side of it, however you want to take and call it. You can see here we've got little clips where you can take and add stuff on also or hook stuff onto the thing. There's also a hooking line here if you want to take and put stuff. You've also got a tie down so you can almost probably get a very light monopod or maybe a tripod in there. You have to be very small but you can kind of get a monopod in there and of course this tie down will take and adjust to whatever you want to put in there. See you can definitely utilize it for that. Now before we go into the top let me show you the bottom. Now what this has is an expandable bottom to where you can expand this. It's got two different zippers that will pull out and this will pull out to a higher range so that you can take and uh, get longer lenses in there. And of course, the beautiful part is, and I don't have my 7200 in here, but you can put the camera in the back and your lens goes up, of course, into the end of the back and away you go. So let's take a look at the top portion of this. Of course, you have the handle. You also have a nice area here where you can put your identity card, business cards, things of that nature that you may want to keep and all that good stuff. Maybe your business card for your photography business. Now, as you can see here, it's got a nice pad that's right here that protects it, as well as the pad at top that protects it. On the inside, you can see here that we have the uh, deepening area that goes down, and of course, it cascades down in a kind of curve to give your 
SLR body, the support that it needs, and of course the lens is going to go down in there. And then of course we have the full Velcro uh, brake area where you can take in, adjust these, take these out. You can make different uh, systems with putting different things at the bottom, of course, and everything else. And of course these got heavy duty pulls on the uh, zippers, of course, as always in here. We've got another pocket where we can take and put stuff and hold stuff and everything else. They think of everything when it comes to this bag. Now, one of the other things that comes with the bag is some extra Velcro grip strips so that you can take and put, you know, adjust the pockets, whatever you have. If you have some other Think Tank bags, you can, of course, have more adjustments. Here's the over-the-shoulder strap that comes with it. It's got a nice rubberized interior so it grips your shoulder instead of sliding around. I love that. And then of course it's got a nice adjustable strap and some heavy duty. You can see here these heavy duty clasps and those of course you can mount on these side panels and of course then you have an over-the-shoulder bag instead of just a carry-all bag. So I definitely love that. Now the other awesome aspect of this bag is the fact that it's built to work with the belts you can get from Think Tank Photo. Now what Think Tank Photo makes, this is a very large belt that I have, of course, because I'm a big man, but they make these pro speed belts and about two other versions of belts on the thinktankphoto.com website. And what these belts do is they go around you and they have different loops that they have. And the loops are designed to work with things like the digital holster. Let me show you what's really cool here. So there's this Velcro ripoff area, becomes exposed, and there's a plastic holder in here, if you will. <clears throat> and so what you'll do is you'll slide the plastic holder down through this grip. And of course you do this the other way because you want this on the outside. Then you close over the holster, Velcro it down, and what you've just created is your very own belt holster kind of gun strap, if you will. <laughs> You're a camera gunslinger. And you can put multiple things on this belt. We'll be reviewing that on a separate post on the ChrisFossShow.com. So you can kind of get an idea as to how this works and the beauty of it. It's multifaceted. I love this where I can just grab this, take it in the car, and know that it's protected. It's not bouncing around my car seat, falling on the floor, getting dirt blown into it, etc., etc. And there's also this wonderful belt fashion where you can use it as a gunslinger sort of thing and you can put up the things. You can of course buy multiple holsters on either side. You can find those on the thinktank.com photo website uh, and or yourself up so you can have a whole different sling of them. And you can quickly and easily access all of your different camera lenses in your gear right from your belt. Very brilliant, brilliant idea. So uh, be sure to check them out. You go to thinktankphoto.com. That's thinktankphoto.com, one of my favorite companies. Check out the Digital Holster 50 version 2.0 and the other digital holster versions. And watch for me to be wearing this at sea at uh, South by Southwest. We'll be wearing this out, taking some photos using our lenses and all that good stuff. Thanks for coming by the ChrisVossShow.com. Chris Voss tested Chris Voss Brew. Give us a like, subscribe to us on YouTube. We'll see you next time.